Hello guys, welcome to my new tutorial. In the last tutorial, we did first person camera. I'm gonna leave the link of the tutorial in the description for those who want to follow. But in this one, we're gonna be creating flashlight. It's very simple, so let's start. First, we're gonna go to the content, to the third person, to the input, to the actions. We're gonna make, uh, gonna make, okay, input action. We're gonna type EA, flashlight, or you can call it whatever you want. We're gonna go back to the input, MC default, and we're gonna add mapping. So here we're gonna select EA flashlight, and we can put whichever key we want. I will put F just for the sake of the tutorial. You can uh, put whatever you want. Let's just save it. So now we have this. We're gonna go back to the third person blueprints, third person character, and here under the follow camera, what we wanna do is we want to add spotlight. This will work as our flashlight. We will call it flashlight. And right now you can see this is our flashlight. Outer cone will be like spread of our flashlight. You can play with this. I will just put it like this. And the inner cone is where the flashlight is gonna be the strongest. So you can just put whatever you like here. You can play with it. I'm gonna compile, save. Then what we want to do is we want to go under the event graph. We're going to type in EA flashlight. And under the started, we want to go and select branch, which will be used here by our Boolean. We're going to call flashlight active. We're going to select this Boolean. We're gonna get it and we're gonna select not boolean. So if the boolean is not true, so if the flashlight is not active, we're gonna get from it set visibility flashlight. We're gonna set visibility, right? But if it's false, we're just gonna so basically, if flashlight is not active, and if this statement is true, we're gonna turn it on. But if the statement is wrong, and the flashlight is active, we're gonna make it go, we're gonna, sorry, we're gonna turn it off, of course. So right now, if we go there, and we test it, we press our F key, oh, it's gonna be visible, right? That's because, we didn't put default visibility off, so you need to uncheck the visible. And now when you go check it, we don't have flashlight, but if we press F, we do. But yes, we cannot turn it off because we need to set our boolean. So we're gonna go flashlight active, set. So if this statement is correct, is true, we're gonna set it visible and we're gonna also put boolean to be true. But here, on the bottom part, we're gonna set boolean false. So right now, if we go to the test, we can check the flashlight can be turned on, can be turned off. So now what we're gonna do when we got this figured out, we want to put sound for our flashlight. So I'm just gonna go here to my audio and I'm gonna put audio, you can put it anywhere, I'll just put it here. You can create a folder for it. So we have audio right now. We are gonna we are gonna go to the third person. We're gonna go to the blueprint, third person character, and here before all of this, we are gonna play to the sound. Play sound to the sorry. Then we're gonna search for the thing that we just added, flashlight sound. Here we go. And now we have sound. So if we go to the compile, we go to the play. We turn here, we have sound. That's it for today. It's very simple tutorial, but in the future, we're gonna cover more of this. And in future, I plan to make more of like horror tutorials than other, but I will try to cover wide thematics of the tutorials. So thank you for watching guys and see you in the next one. Bye.